need some. So what do you just put in your mouth? The best caviar in the world. And you're tasting it a certain way, so I understand you're supposed to let it sit in your mouth? Basically, you have to cleanse your palate first. Then you take uh, the caviar, you put it on your tongue, fill the eggs, roll them around, let them sit there. The taste will grow in you. At the beginning, it's salty, then becomes very sweet, very buttery, nutty. It's a really a pleasant taste. It's an it's a expression of pleasure. When you taste caviar, it's, it's pure pleasure. Now, this caviar is coming from? New Brunswick, from our company, Acadian Sturgeon and Caviar. It's a company I started with my wife uh, here uh, 10 years ago. and. Uh, to produce, again, the best sturgeon caviar in the world and also to use all the fish, not only the caviar. Now, let's talk about the caviar. What makes it the best in the world, in your opinion? At this moment, is because, one, is because it's one of these uh, last wild sustainable caviars that we can harvest. Second, it is a fully marine species, so they leave the fish, the mothers, the, the parents, they live in, uh, in the uh, ocean. Uh, many other sturgeon species actually are freshwater or brackish. Uh, and, uh, and also, again, it's sustainable, so we, we do it, we are sure, 100% that is well done. Okay. What are people saying here at the show? They love it. I can. Uh, I want to do a little movie, caviar before and after, because I, I, I see people, first timers, for example, they'll be worried first. They think, oh, do I do this? Do I go to put this in my mouth? And then look at this. You see? Right? Right. You see a before and after look. Before and after, yeah. So you just take it on, you listen to me. Just put it on your tongue. Put it on your tongue? Just put it there and kind of feel the eggs and let them let it sit. follow me. Really? The eyes will open up. You should put it yeah. uh, We can do a better than, than it is. What it is, the prices are somewhere here. It's okay. 75 is the little one. But we can do better for you. Okay, let's talk about the... Uh, do the wholesale price. Let's talk about the sturgeon. Sturgeon, again, the fish, uh, caviar is only it's only 5% of the, of, the, of the fish. You don't want to waste it only for the eggs, you know. We basically sell, sell everything, including the skin. Those are sturgeon skins, real sturgeon skins in the back. We do smoked sturgeon, we do a smoked sturgeon pate on top, which is also delicious. We have loins, we have grind meat, we have cell cartilage, fins, stripe, everything. What do you do with the skin? The skins is mainly decoration and marketing tools. Then people eat them. Actually, there are people in Hong Kong who can cook it. You can actually really eat it. Um, and uh, it's really good. Take one of these. Thank you. From the house. <laughs> and, uh, what's very unique about the uh, sturgeon? Sturgeon is a, it's a very meaty fish. It doesn't have any bones. I mean, any fish, you know, bones are deterring people from eating fish. You know, especially if you have kids, you don't want them to chalk on things and things like that. It's a meaty fish, very clean. They, uh, the fish are eating, uh, you know, at the bottom of the ocean. Uh, like us eating oysters. They only eat, uh, not like tuna, half on the, on the food chain, you know. We've been testing all the fish, no mercury, no PCBs, they're pretty good. Well, let's ask uh, Chef uh, Elzer. Uh, you're a chef. Uh, what's your experience and feedback in serving uh, the uh, sturgeon or the caviar here? The caviar here? Uh, it's been an amazing, an amazing opportunity. Thank you. The, uh, people, love, people love it. It's, it's great. To me, too, I've tasted many caviars out there, and this is probably far out the best is in the world. Really? Yes. It has a uh, very complex taste. It's salty, it's buttery, it's nutty, and it's it's a taste that comes back and that lingers in your mouth for about 10 minutes. So it's just perfect. Well, how would you, uh, what would you pair this with, since we're at a gourmet food and wine show? Yeah, if we go for wine, it's a dry white wine or a, a Prosecco or a Champagne or even a, a white liquor like a, 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 what I was saying, a Geneva or a uh, vodka, ice cold. Great. What's your favorite dish in using this in your menu? Uh, well, you know what? It's funny, but lately we came up with some uh, ground meat from the sturgeon, and we made uh, burgers with it. That's original. And it was it was amazing. It was amazing. Yeah. That we would made fly. Sturgeon burgers. That would that'd be a, a huge. That'd go viral. Yeah, no, it was good. Good. All right. Thank you so much. That is the smoked sturgeon. So uh, and the smoked sturgeon pate. We're going to get uh, his website. Uh, Thank you. Do you want to read it out to me? This 
that is here? Or? It's www.acadianpaststurgeon.com. Great. Again, your website. Uh, they will shatter it. Just drop them on a cement floor or whatever, because it's not a rock. He's busy. Let's let him, let him finish.